Alexia Bonga Slabisa is the uh, Western Cape chairperson of the e-hailing Western Cape Sia Bonga. How are drivers being affected? Last week, e-hailing drivers said that they largely support the stay away and that they would also be parking their cars uh, this weekend in and around the CBD. I saw a number of e-hailing vehicles. Uh, what is e-hailing Western Cape's position on this ongoing strike? Uh, good morning, Vanessa. Good morning to the listeners and the drivers. Um, yeah, it's um, we we have that uh, uh, we took a decision that we we in solidarity of Sataco we had to to join them and go to go on strike. But um, yeah, there are drivers that we have been operating, but some of them there was because of um, they were not aware that we are also part. But we have done our job to go around and mobilize them, and share the information that we are also taking part to the stay away. Similar reasons as per the the, the taxi industry. Yes, that's correct. Uh, but it might be, um, you know, in, in this industry, unfortunately, the, the law enforcement and the, all the complaints that have been uh, tabled out by Santaco, some of them, they were very relevant to, to, to us. For instance, um, the case that we, as the healing uh, drivers, we have been impounded uh, almost um, 150 to 200 vehicles every week. And we've been also, um, if you remember, been going around and having uh, protests about the same matter. Even we are still having the issue, the fact that the, uh, the permit that has been um, allocated, which is 2,462 permits, we also still not satisfied because as far as we know, after we had meeting with the uh, e uh, platforms and, and apps, would they confirm to us that the data that was submitted was over 6,000, but we are still complaining the fact that the city is just giving us uh, a very quarter of permits because they know that they will continue impounding us. And also, we, there is a lot of things that is involved. In last week, we had complaints that there were cars were getting fines, um, uh, those operating without a meter on their dash, and also they were getting even uh, some of them impoundment. The issue of radius also to us is a concern because some of the drivers, they have to get fines if they drive to other areas, but the e-hailing platform, it really does not work um, or drives with the radius because they pick up wherever they are. So all the challenges were, were similar uh, to the same challenges that we, we are having. Because it looked like the the city and the Western Cape province, there's a confusion on issuing the permit and the correct uh, law that need to be enforced by the law enforcement. Siabonga Slabisa, e hailing Western Cape chairperson.